55 Slate Team. It's your boy Andy and welcome back to the DeFi Slate YouTube channel. Smash the like button on this video that really helps us out and sit back and enjoy the content. Thank you very much. Back to Sushi Swap, my favorite decks. Welcome back to the DeFi Slate YouTube channel. It's your boy Andy back today with another video, another tutorial for you guys. And yes, sir, we are going to be farming today. And you guessed it, it's going to be a multi-chain farm as we've been doing and keeping up the pace with the multi-chain world. I really think it's the biggest opportunity right now in DeFi to get ahead. I mean, it, it's like Ethereum was back in the day, 2020, early 2020, when we started this channel. Um, you know, it was fun. It was low gas fees, high yields, and really low liquidity. There wasn't a lot of users. Ethereum is just jammed now. There's so many users, so much liquidity. So, you know, for a lot of us, uh, people that are trying to get in there and farm with smaller amounts, and you know, get early early access and better yields. Uh, we're looking to the multi-chain world, and today's chain that we're exploring is the Celo network. So we're going to show you guys Sushi Swap on Celo, how to get access to Celo, how to bridge, and how to farm. So let's do it. So first, um, you know, you you're going to want to start with some funds in your Ethereum wallet. Um, so this this wallet has a very small amount of funds in it. Um, so you know, we're, for the point of the of the demonstration. We'll just happily kind of show you what this looks like. Um, so in this example, you're going to need a minimum of $10 to bridge. So let's say we had one ETH to bridge, um, right? It's it's only allowing us to do our smallest balance, but that's okay, right? All you got to do here is literally come to and press CELO. Make sure that the destination address is the same address as your MetaMask and hit bridge. It's that simple, guys. You pay the transaction fee and, and it'll get to your... It'll get to your... Uh, to your MetaMask wallet connected to, to the CELO network uh, pretty quickly. I think five, 10 minutes uh, or so. This is the, so this is the optics.app bridge. It's the bridge that, that I would use to get over to CELO. Um, so I'm not gonna walk you guys through the bridge because it's gonna take us some time, but it's super simple, right? You're able to get your assets there onto CELO using the optics bridge, um, optics.app. Now, what you wanna do is come over to chainlist.org and add the CELO mainnet. So I'm gonna go ahead and add to MetaMask. I'm gonna approve. I'm gonna go ahead and allow it to switch. All right, so you can see I have zero CELO, but I am connected to the CELO network uh, through the MetaMask wallet. And when I come to Sushi, I'm on CELO. This is it, here it is. And the big thing about CELO is the mobile DeFi. So a lot of DeFi right now has been through the through your computer, through your laptop, through your desktop, right? Whatever it is, your DeFi has been done on the computer. What CeeLo is trying to do is do mobile first DeFi, which I think is going to be huge. Um, so, you know, this is Sushi Swap on CeeLo. Again, guys, super familiar with this stuff. Um, you know, this is Sushi Swap, right? It's super simple. Um, it's kind of how you get going. And I mean, it's as, as easy as it gets, right? So, if you want to start farming, what you're going to want to do is find a pool to add. And in order to find those pools, you can come to farm. So, check it out. Okay. So these pools are pretty sweet. So this is basically a stable coin pool right now at 100% a year, insane. Here's another stable coin pool at 100% per year. Um, and here's a CeeLo ETH pool, which watch out for the impermanent loss guys. There's definitely gonna be some on this one, um, but just be careful. And here's a stable coin, effectively uh, stable Euro pool with ETH at 229%. So if you're not frothing at the, at the chops right now, I don't know what to tell you. This is a, as as great as it gets for yield farming on a multi-chain world. Um, yeah, the fees are absurdly low and it's super quick as well. So how I'd play this is I would get into a stable strategy and milk that as much as I can. Yes, I know the market is bullish. Yes, I know everybody is long. And yes, I do know that CeeLo is also bullish as a token, um, you know, and so I do understand these things, but I'm telling you guys, and you, when you can get 100% or close to 100% yield on stables, you just do it. You, you just do it. All right, so um, that is a good farm to, to start with. And then I, I, I would probably hop into uh, any one of these three, uh, this one being the most risky. So you can think of this as basically the pool two farm, you know, because you, you're earning CeeLo and you have that as your, as your base. Again, if you're bullish on CeeLo long term, this is a great farm to be in because as ETH goes up, it'll pull CeeLo up w with it. Um, in this trading pair, you you'll always be selling ETH to buy CeeLo if, if ETH goes up. So that's good. Um, you'll be accumulating more CeeLo. And if you're bullish on CeeLo long term, this is definitely a good pool to be in because you're getting a bunch of sushi and CeeLo rewards. I love this pool. I love sushi. 
I like CeeLo a lot. <laughs> Do you guys notice the difference there? It's funny. Um, and so, yeah, I mean, I think this is a really cool pool. You just got to watch out for the impermanent loss, um, which basically means if ETH goes up a lot and CeeLo lags or if CeeLo goes way up or uh, and, you know, ETH pulls back, you can kind of get some impermanent loss. A really cool way to um, um, find out what your impermanent loss is is to go to the uh, Netlify impermanent loss calc. Um, so this is a really cool app and it'll show you like, okay, so like for example, um, let's say we have CeeLo and Wrapped ETH and the, the pool weights are 50-50. And so let's say CeeLo goes up 200% and ETH only goes up, you know, 45%. So you would lose 6% of your position, less so than if you just held the equal amount of CeeLo and ETH. But, but you're getting this. So this is gonna cover any impermanent loss, in my opinion, unless something crazy happens where, you know, CeeLo goes up 200% or what would be more likely would be CeeLo goes down, you know, 20%, 20% and ETH goes up 100% and you're like, wait, how did that happen? You know, then you would get a bigger impermanent loss. But in my judgment, if ETH is going up 100%, that means the entire market is about to go insane. Um, you know, and I would expect CeeLo to go up somewhere like 150% or something like that. Right, and so in that case, you're getting plenty of yield rewards, plenty, and you're not really worried about impermanent loss. Now, in these in these cases, with the C year pair and the CUSD pair, when you come to the calculator, you can always assume that this is gonna change by zero. So no matter what, there's gonna be impermanent loss. So if you're kind of neutral on price action right now, you don't really know if it's gonna go up or down, these are some good pools to be in, C year, CUSD, wrapped ETH. You know, because if, if ETH goes up 10%, you know, sure, there's, there's a tiny bit of impermanent loss, 20%, a, a, you know, a little bit, but you're protecting your downside and, and you're definitely getting quite a bit of yield, right? So I would totally check out impermanent loss on the Baller app uh, and just kind of see what you're doing. You know, let's also have a look at CeeLo to kind of see what, what we're looking at here. So price looks bullish, up 12% today. It really looks like it's it's rising right now. Um, so definitely something to you know note as you as you kind of see and explore uh, what's happening with the yield opportunities, right? So you know the price does rise, um, you know in the last few days you can buy these on these exchanges, but guys you know what you can really do is just go on to Sushi Swap and bridge over using DeFi. Um, let's see, is Sushi in here? I don't see Sushi. Okay, that's no worries. Um, what what you can do is you can go to Sushi Swap and just bridge over some ETH, and then all of a sudden, you know, you 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 have yourself your CeeLo. You don't have to go through any centralized exchanges. Um, and so yeah, this is the stablecoin CeeLo Dollar. Market cap's still relatively low, so you you would assume that the slippage on Sushi might be a little bit. Um, I guess what we can do is we can go to um, the analytics. Let's see where we can find the analytics here. Um, tools, vesting, um, dev, open source, docs, silo. Hmm, is there a chart? Let's see. Um, pool. No, I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm not seeing where we can see the analytics. Um, but what you can do is you can see the CeeLo Block Explorer as well. This is going to be a really good tool for you guys to kind of make sure that you're watching out what's happening. Um, you know, it shows you the chart, it shows you what, what what's going on, some of the tokens available. Um, so there might be some alpha in this. UbiSwap looks interesting. Um, let's check out UbiSwap real quick. Um, Oh, CeeLo Dex. Look, this is it. Mobile first DeFi. This is going to be huge, guys. Um, it's going to be absolutely huge. So let's see what the app looks like. All right. Basically a Uniswap clone. So there's quite a few wallets that you can use here. Um, you know, we have the MetaMask account connected on CeeLo. And here we go. Okay. Okay. All right. All right, some decent yields here, but nothing really compared to what we saw in Sushi Swap. Um, definitely some decent deposits here as well. Yeah, so I mean, pretty decent APY here. Um, doesn't compare to Sushi Swap, just a little bit less. Um, here's another good one, USDC CeeLo, so kind of in between. Pretty good yield there. Um, yeah, so that's that. That's interesting. I think there's definitely some alpha here, guys. If you want to look at some at, at some of these tokens, you know, kind of getting early in to some of these with not a lot of holders. Yet, yeah, I think um, there's going to be a, an interesting kind of play here. You notice how there's only you know a few thousand 
few hundred holders for some of these on CeeLo. So um, definitely early to CeeLo chain. I'll check out SushiSwap to start. Check out those farms that we showed. Um, the bridge is the optics.app bridge. Super simple, guys. Um, and the baller app will show you the impermanent loss. Um, and of course, you guys can check out CoinGecko um, and the CeeLo ecosystem all through CoinGecko. Um, and yeah, pretty small, guys. Pretty new. Um, but CeeLo looks... See, it looks good. Looks pretty good. So uh, keep your eyes out, all right? And uh, good luck out there farming. Be careful. Only bridge what you can afford to lose, quote unquote. Um, you know, no financial advice here, um, but we do enjoy uh, what we're looking at here on SushiSwap, and I think, I think it's going to be a good play. So 